Hey everyone, I am Mr. Helper and today I will going to show you how to add your own music in Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Or you can also say how to play your own music in Grand Theft Auto Vice City radio station. Both are same things. This is a requested video. That means one of you have asked me a question in one of my video. Today, Shravani Prasant asked me, Mr. Helper, can you please tell me how to enable sound in GTA Vice City? because I enabled it but the radio station does not play. I copied the audio file in GTA Vice City but the radio station does not play. Please tell me. I hope you are watching this video Shravani. Uh, I'm sorry if I'm not pronouncing your name correctly. Please don't mind. Okay. Okay, there's one more thing that I want to tell you. This video might be a long one because I will gonna explain each and everything in pretty detail. Rest assured, once you watch this video completely, you don't have to watch any other video. If you get this problem again, then you know how to fix it. So that's been said, let's get started. Okay, the very first thing that you have to do is simply go to the location where have you installed your Grand Theft Auto Vice City. Right click on the shortcut and click on open file location. But if you have bought this game in Steam, then what you have to do is simply go to the library of Steam. Right click on the game, click on properties, click on local files and click on browse like this. Okay. Okay, once you open the location where have you installed your GTA Vice City, what you have to do is create a folder. Right click and click on, I mean move your mouse over new and click on folder. Now name it mp3 like this. Don't write it like this. Okay, please make sure to write each and everything in lowercase. Just like this. Now open the folder. Okay, now all you have to do is simply paste your music file over here. That's all you have to do. But wait, there is a catch. Let me tell you. GTA Vice City only supports .mp3 format file. What does that mean? Let me explain. Open the location where have you stored your music file. Okay, these are the music, let me play. Okay, so as you can see, this is a music, okay, but there is a catch that I said before. Click on view, click on file name extension, okay. As you can see, as I said, GTA Vice City supports only .mp3 format file, but this audio file is in .wav format. Now what we can do? We have to convert this file in .mp3 format. How we can do that? Let me explain. Open VLC Media Player and guys, I want to mention one more thing. If you don't know how to download and install VLC Media Player, then I'm not gonna explain that in this video because this video become already a quite long one and I don't want to make it a longer one. But not to worry, I have already made a video on this topic, how to download and install VLC Media Player. I'm gonna leave that video link in the description box below. Please watch that video if you are interested, if you don't know how to install VLC Media Player. I'm assuming that you already have VLC Media Player with you. Now what you have to do is Open VLC Media Player, then click on Media, then click on Convert and Save, I mean Convert or Save. Then drag and drop your music file over here. Okay. Now click on Convert slash Save. Now, right over here in Profile, scroll down and select Audio MP3. Select it. Now click on Browse. Then uh, create a folder named as anything. It's up to you. Name it whatever you want to. Okay. And I'm gonna name it. Wait. I'm gonna name this file as Last Train Home. Okay. Name doesn't matter. Uh, doesn't matter. Okay. Click on save. 
click on start that's all you have to do now simply copy this file and paste it inside now get back to gta vice city install location remember we have created mp3 for folder over here just paste this music file over here that's all you have to do now let's run the game and see does it work or not Increase the volume as much you want, okay? I'm gonna keep it like this. As you can see, music is playing. We interrupt your programming with a message from the State Department. Okay, so this is how you can add your music in GTA Vice City. Okay, but there's one more shortcut way to do this. Okay, I mean, I didn't mean to say shortcut. Okay, there's one more thing I want to add here. In my case, I have only 3 music files. But what about you? If you are having around 20-50 music files, it is not possible for you to copy entire music file and paste it inside mp3 folder over here. Right? So what you can do is, just create the shortcut files of this music files. Just like this. Just create the shortcut files. Okay? And things to be remember guys, I am using .wav format. So these two music will not gonna play because uh, these files formats are not supported. But this is just a demonstration. Just assume that these are the .mp3 file format. Okay. Once you create the shortcut of this uh, music files, just cut the shortcut and paste it inside GTA Vice City install location inside that mp3 folder will be there as we know we have created it by ourselves paste it over here that's all you have to do okay now just run the game and one more thing guys i forgot to mention before doing any of these steps please make sure that your ycity was not running if your ycity was running this will not gonna work so please make sure your ycity was not running at all at the beginning of the video i forgot to mention that Okay guys, so this is how you can add your own music in GTA Vice City and play it on radio station. Before I end this video, I want to add few more things that you might find interesting. If you are interested in this type of videos, then I am happy to tell you this. I have created a separate playlist named as How to GTA. In that playlist, I have added lots of videos like how to add your own music in GTA 3, how to add your own music in GTA 5 how to add your own music in GTA 4 and videos like that. So if you are interested then please check the description box below. I will gonna leave that playlist link in the description box below. And one more thing guys, I have a second channel named as Spapno. Sometimes I go live on that channel. So if you are interested to watch me live then please check the description box below. I will gonna leave all the social website links of my second channel Spapno. So if you are interested then please check the description box below, visit my second channel and subscribe me, follow me over there, it's all up to you, no pressure, okay? So that's all for today, thank you for watching this video, it's time to say goodbye, so until then, 
Take care, have a nice day and I will see you next time. Bye.